I remember being a new officer. I wasn't a police officer before. Hilliard sent me to the academy, and you know, I was always so worried I was going to do something wrong. And I remember Sean just stopping me one day and saying, "Hey, I got your back. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna let you get in trouble. I'm not gonna let you hurt yourself or anybody else. Just do what I'm teaching you, and you'll be fine." And that was Sean. He wasn't. He didn't say a whole lot, but when he did, it meant that much. I had ridden with him numerous times. We'd broken bread together. And when you get to know somebody, um, you know, and you lose them, it's it's a really hard time. And as I wrote the speech, all of those emotions continued to well up. To go through this week as we have, knowing that. Uh, Today was the anniversary of his death. It really brought back a lot of the emotions that, that I experienced last year when it happened. When Sean made his last trip through the city of Hilliard, I think the outpouring from the community really showed all of us how much the people of this community think of our first responders. Every, every day I'm, I'm thankful that I can one, be a police officer, and two, serve in a community that appreciates their first responders. Hillier is a very special place. Um, this is a community that cares about our first responders and the support that we have had here I think is second to none. And uh, it, it helps us uh, knowing that we have the support of our community to be able to do the job that we do.